Uh, of course, we talk about a lot of important issues here on the program. The United States House of Representatives deals with a lot of important issues, but right now they're spending a considerable amount of time talking about milk. Today, they considered a bipartisan bill that would allow schools to serve whole milk instead of just fat-free or low-fat. The bill says whole milk contains many health benefits like better bone health and lower blood pressure. Back here uh, with the panel, Julia, I feel like we need a dot, dot, dot. Um, sponsored by many representatives with yeah. large dairy farms in their <laughs> districts. Absolutely, absolutely. Yep, that's a fair point. But at the same time, I think there's an argument to say that much of the obesity epidemic in this country yep. happened with low fat. Yeah, low fat yeah. milk, chocolate yep. milk, that's a big, a big issue. Mm -hmm. um, Diet soda. <laughs> yeah, there you go. All right, so that, that's, we're going to have on later tonight, uh, just in an hour, uh, on balance, both one of the sponsors of the bill uh, and also a pediatrician who's talking a lot about the issues you guys just talked about, about the low fat craze, uh, whether or not you should be able to have flavored milk uh, in America's high schools, whether or not you should have a right to flavored milk, uh, as some members of Congress uh, would like as well. That's tonight, 7 Eastern, right here on News Nation. Thanks for watching. Go to NewsNationNow.com to find NewsNation on your television provider. And don't forget to subscribe. Click the red button to get more of NewsNation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.